People say that in C and C++, it's faster to pass small objects by value instead of by reference. But why is it faster? Two of the main types of memory which programs use are registers, which are small and fast to access, and the stack, which is larger but <laughs> slower to access. Say we want to pass a cat treat to a function called eat treat, represented by marshmallow over here. If we pass by value, we simply take our treat, put it in a register, pass the register to a function, who then takes the treat straight out of the register. Come on, the treat. If instead we want to pass by reference, we have to allocate space on our stack, put our treat on the stack, and then in the register, we put a little note saying where on the stack the value is. If we then want to pass the treat to a function, we have to pass the note in the register to the function, who will find out where it is stored. Then they can get the treat out of the box. How does this actually look in the assembly code generated by the compiler? Let's find out. Here we've got a couple of examples. They both call a function and pass in the integer 42. The only difference here is that one takes the int by const reference and one takes it by value. If we look at the disassembly view in VS Code, we can see that for the by value example, it generates just a move. This is the value 42. It just moves 42 into this register and then jumps to the function by value. For the reference version, however, things are a bit more complicated. First, we have to allocate some space in the stack, which we do by subtracting from the stack pointer. Then we load the address which we just allocated into RCX, which is where the argument to the function goes. Then we're going to store 42 into that memory location, then call by reference. And once by reference returns, we need to clear up our stack and then return ourselves. This is a bunch more instructions, and the callee is now going to have to get the value from cached memory instead of the fast registers. So this is one reason why you should consider passing small objects by value instead of reference.